It seemed like the intention of the filmmakers was to show that these religious, very religious people, are also very ordinary people in many ways. They could be leaders in business or any other profession. I find that in my own case and in the cases of these individuals that we struggle finding a way to create a bridge between tradition and the transcendent that these traditions try to give expression to. Create a bridge between the tradition and between a predominantly secular society. It showed a very human side to religion and that uh, there are people within religious traditions that struggle to try to make it real for their friends and families and uh, people they care about. I think the film did a really good job of showing four people in four different religions um, taking on the roles of the leaders or the priests or the rabbis or whatever within their religion. You know, they were younger, they were taking on responsibility, they were learning from other people, they were, were adding their own twist. I, I just felt they were really young um, and that <laughs> they were filled with selfhood and they were called to be leaders and it wouldn't matter. It just so happened that they had all gotten programmed in a certain religious track, wouldn't have mattered if they were programmed into business. They would have been, you know, Bill Gates or something. Sometimes the, the <laughs> religious folk have authority, gives them, uh, calling gives them authority, where if I'm called to be a doctor or I'm called to be an accountant, I don't have that same authority base that a metaphor system gives you. It seems the personalities in this film are, the individuals in this film are responding to uh, the transcendent in that it's, uh, they feel that the purpose of their lives is not to, um, you know, advance their own careers for the sake of themselves or their families, but uh, really it's more of a selfless uh, desire to serve their community and to serve humanity and uh, in doing so serving God.